Hey, how's it going, guys? We're going to uh, put a little something together today. We're we'll cooking the heart of a bear, and this is the uh, the most tender, tenderest of the animal. You know, so we're going to uh, cook that up. Is it like a stir fry? So let's get on with it. Hey, first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna go ahead and let everything warm up. I'm gonna put just a little bit. This is what we call maple shine. Just a little bit in the bottom. Just to keep it from sticking, give it a little bit of flavor, flavor too. Let that heat up, okay. The next thing we're gonna do, we're gonna slice up the heart. Different pieces. See how lean that meat right there is? Slice that. They say in the old, old guys, to be the animal, you always eat the heart. Know what they're thinking. So it's it's more like a tradition with the guys that eat it and and all. But it is the most tender of it. And I cut it up into smaller hunks. One reason it get done quicker, but fixing a stir fry, I want to give it that. Boy, it's a good, good flavoring. Let's see. Let's cut this one more time. This across. But you always want to cut it up like this because especially for a bear or a wild hog you always got to watch out for uh, heartworms so it's always better to cut it up make sure everything is good and clear Little pieces there get another one taken care of here out oh, that right there on the, on the muscle and be a little tough right there so let's take that off and then we'll cut it that's some pieces there this would be Take all the lean meat in it. You're definitely good to have a good sharp filleting knife. And watch those fingers. Put that there. Well, surprise the woman there with a little wine and candlelight, a little bare heart. We won't tell her what it is to let you taste it and see what she thinks. can't go wrong with it. Yep. 
shine. Make a good mixture there. We'll put just a little more to it. To let this brown up. tell Casey this is how I know how what a bear is thinking every move they make and how I know to go and cut them off go to different places when they're running you know it's like souped up rabbit hunting bear will always come back where it started from because they're territorial so we'll get them there's just so many ways that you can fix these bears and all and it just you know, and that meat is so clean Good and red. And I think we're good right there. Okay. Okay, now we got our meat. Got into the bowl. Flip our board over. We're going to get some bell pepper here. We're going to slice it up. That bell pepper is the trick on any kind of food I, in my opinion it just has a flavoring of its own pull that core out all right we'll slice her down let's take this right here right out. Some may leave it in. I'll just take it out. It's with it, you know, so we make it long strips. Seeds. Seeds give it good flavor. peppers then we'll take some wild onions so we like these I ain't much for eating on the onions but as far as cooking it's hard to beat you know here we go all the green. Same way. Get the ends off.
for that. Okay. Okay, now we got our bare heart. We're gonna slide our meat into it. Saute it around. Go a little seasoning. It's a little, it's a little brown sugar and bourbon. We we'll put a little sea salt. And of course, I can't do that without my favorite. I always like the lemon pepper. So we turn it up just a little bit now. Get that ready. We're going to brown this real good. quicker we'll have it at that okay now we got our lid Take it around heating good hunks add our onions then we're going to add our bell peppers that all around there lid's still a little hot so this vector here We'll let that cook right there for about 20 minutes, and we'll be on. We cooking this bar. I sit back and I was telling Casey, and I said, "Remember, I had, that bar kept getting back there on her place. I couldn't get it to leave, so I decided I'd take advantage of it and get work some little pups on that bar." But he wouldn't come down the tree. Every time he wouldn't leave, he'd just go up the tree. So I said, well, so I got me a stick. So I climbed that tree. We got in there with that bar. So, so he was on one side of the tree and I was on the other side of the tree. So every time he'd pop in teeth, he'd, he'd swat that paw at me. He'd swat it around and I'd take that stick and I'd crack that knuckle for him. Just back and forth, back and forth. He'd put smack. I'd smack him. He, it was just on and on just to get him down out of that tree. Sometimes you got to do a little work to get him out of there and get them moving. But it's always an adventure. And that's what it's all about, making memories. And I've been lucky enough to have my kids on a lot of these hunts and stuff with me and still hunting. They ain't slowed down. They're still hunting. They're getting out on their own a little more now, leaving Pop behind, but old Pop goes on his own too and still comes up with these bears. Hmm. Pay attention, kids. Pay attention. I always got to thank them because eat this bear heart, you'll know what them bears thinking. You can get ahead of them. Be sitting right there waiting when they come or at least know how to catch up with them. Finished. 
product. Cut it down. Still see the moonshine. It's still so there, giving it that little flavor. The bell pepper just just sort of sucks that right up in there. And guys, there it is. Bear heart, fixed it. A little candlelight, a little wine. I think the little woman will be fine, happy, or a little later. We're gonna cover it up. Save it, everything's getting marinated real good, just a little iced seasoning in it. But check it out. Check out the videos, like and subscribe. And remember guys, everything going on today, a woman they really love it when you can get out here and you can hunt, get out here, take it to the table, kill it, fix it, grill it up, cook it up yourself, and take care of that, you know. So and it's also it's just making memories, you know. It, it's just it's just things that comes out that your children will tell their children and so on. And so along with, such as with these videos, uh, it just helps out from the show. A lot of times you can show somebody something a whole lot quicker than you can tell them. It makes it a lot better. But until uh, next round, we'll see what's going on. We've got some... Uh, all our bear season is over, deer season's over, so we're getting into raccoon and all that. So we got some good recipes on that too. So uh, just hang around, and check it out later. <music>